Welcome back everybody to a new episode of Battletech. So, uh, I've just looked a little bit through our mech warriors and we do have some experience to distribute, not too much, but uh, Spectre has, uh, can add something to tactics, so she doesn't have as much indirect fire penalty anymore, I think that should be good. And... What else do we have? Behemoth has a little bit, but I don't think it's worth putting anything at the moment. I think we'll wait for the 900 XP. I don't think the rest are yet there yet. So I'm not sure what I want to do with glitch. I mean, we can we can go to 444 maybe. That's fine. And you, we could. Go towards sensor locking. So just do that. Good to go. And you can't do anything. All right. So, um, do we have any mechs that need our attention at the moment? It doesn't seem like it is. So, we should be good to go to the next contract. And I think since this is not, these are not our main pilots now, we actually will do the half skull mission first so this is a defend base mission in the badlands the badlands biome is a wind scoured wasteland with little vegetation and little water the extreme heat makes it more difficult for max to see sink heat fields of crystalline mineral deposits interfere with targeting systems making it harder to shoot into them as well as to shoot out of them. Okay, so uh, this will be interesting with our set of mechs. I am expecting some overheating. What's the difference between a desert and a badlands? That sounds pretty similar to me. Uh, anyway, so this is a, a defend base mission, which uh, sh I don't know, should be challenging. We operate a repair and maintenance facility on Detroit. This base is critical to our operations in the system and we suspect that Morik forces are going to assault the facility. We'd like you to, to garrison the base and if an attack comes, hold off the assault until our forces can arrive and relieve you. All right, let, let's do it. Um, <clears throat> we don't need as much money anymore. But since this is a half skull mission, I don't really expect anything useful either. So we'll go for more money, I guess. Not sure. So, uh, you guys are out. And instead, we will have Medusa piloting the... This Vindicator is the one with... Yes, this is the, the range Vindicator. So that's fine. We will have. Hmm. We'll have Fork in the Shadow Hawk, Buster in the Spider, and Tap Room in, in the other Vindicator. Hopefully, I mean, this is. I'm not sure whether this works fine, but. Hope for the best. Deploy. Let's do it. We'll see. I mean, we do have basically two stars uh, drop worth of dropping. Uh, I also read that the mod pack is suppose is not supposed to make the early game much harder, but it will rather get uh, much dicier in the late game, since that was a little bit of the weak point in, in the base game. So uh, I don't expect too much of a difficulty increase for the time being, so we may be able to pro progress a little bit faster but I still I'm not too sure about the new AI so I want to like, get some practice in with the, to just to fight the new AI and see how it behaves a little bit so because this is still an Iron Man challenge and uh, I don't want to take unnecessary risks <clears throat> Just as predict, Commander, this isn't going to be boring guard duty. We're tracking multiple incoming hostile, uh, incoming hostiles and picking up Marik chatter. Hang on tight, Commander. This should get ugly. All right. All right. Yeah. Here we go. So, I have done one base defense previously, and it was pretty easy. But we were on the high ground at that time around. So I think. We should try to move 
in front of the building so that they, they would rather attack us than the buildings I guess. Uh -huh. So we'll stay on the road with our main forces. And maybe the spider can go here. So, uh, hold on for local government. So we need to hold on for 10 rounds and four out of eight buildings must survive. And we should, we will get a bonus if yeah, all buildings on. survive. So there is a... Uh, Incoming mechs and those seem to be light mechs. Uh, what do I want to do? Shall we go into reserve? They go also into reserve. That's interesting. I would have assumed that the new AI would go straight up and shoot the building. Now this building is very exposed, unfortunately. So yeah, um, we cannot shoot. Anyway, so let's just move ahead and maybe we'll we can absorb a shot that doesn't go onto the building. Well, I'm not sure if it is a good idea if you just trample all the buildings down. Yeah, uh, when we should actually defend it. But I mean, it is what it is. So 18% are oh, crap. Why can't we fire? Why is there... Why is this line not fireable? Move. I'm really not sure. Evasive. And the locust. I think... We may should go in and try to melee them. Hopefully nothing will come from the from the other side. The map is pretty big. I'm afraid that we may have and oh, because we sprinted. That's why we couldn't fire. I forgot. Okay. Dumb little me. So you go up ahead as well. So what uh weapons? Oh there is a third one. So you have a medium laser and two machine guns, also same here. This one is a little bit dicier, but all of them seem to be relatively short ranged. So... Huh. Twenty six percent. I think it's probably the best move we can make at the moment. Maybe we do hit something. I also would like to see how it affects our heat. Like okay, both misses. It's a shame, but expected. Okay, so they attacking the Shadowhawk, which is perfectly fine by me. As long as they don't attack the buildings, that is all really good. good to go. Now, so this guy is... I mean, we can move over here and shoot him in the back. Or him. Well, we don't... we have a better chance here, so maybe we should do this. The problem is, if I do that, he may run around us and attack us from the back, so maybe we should rather... do something else like go here I mean that's still 36% I guess we shall take it and we hit at least one of them so can't complain about that so he goes attacks the building well the buildings seem to have some HP so well, at least... Ah, yeah, they can take a beat. Not ya. too much, but still. So, 
now. Good to go. What if we shoot from here? That's pretty. All of that. All of those are pretty terrible, to be honest. I mean, the AC5 and the LRM is is, uh, ex is logical that they don't hit because we are too near. This guy has too much evasion. So should we just kick him in the face? May actually be better. We should do more damage by with kicking him in the face. So let's just uh, do that. Got it. This is and it be good. should. Oh Jesus! Holy shit! Did you yeah, I see it. It was amazing. You just knocked him out straight out of the bat. Pretty good, actually. Okay, so, um, well... Orders. What about you? Well, that's... that. Those aren't the worst odds. I think we'll take those. Heading out. To be honest. Cannot get much better than this, I think. This is the guy uh, that actually should not hit anything, but... Well... Well, I guess, yeah, he didn't hit... <laughs> this, he should have hit something, but he didn't, so, I mean, yeah... Uh, <laughs> makes sense. Okay, so, now, you... Fifty-eight. You move back because you are long range. I still, I'm still not too fond about the LRMs. Like the hit percent chance is so bad. I mean, maybe we are too close. Oh, maybe we can hit the leg actually. Jesus. Well, that was a catastrophe. Yeah. Fuck. Okay, yeah, just just hit, you got nothing, you hear just me? hit our guys. So where's the bloody reinforcement coming from? We don't know. Or do we? Bec no, those are just these two guys. He has one evasion. So maybe we should. I don't know. Reserve for the time being and see what the other guy does. Is that a medium mech or it, it looks like it's a medium mech. You are Can we get some information? You are a light mech. Okay. Strangely. And you have three evasions. Waiting on well. You, I mean, we do have a 78% chance to just hit him in the back. Let's just do that. He's much more dangerous than the other guy. Light leg destroyed. So oh, that's left leg destroyed. Perfect. So he has no evasion anymore. And we can fire away. So, which means you. Commander. If you shoot here. Ah, those are still pretty bad. Odds, considering that he is lying on the ground. I'm not sure whether I like that. What about y what about you? Commander. You could also f you have a 95% chance to hit him, him for 55 damage. Maybe we should... What if we just fire from here? Yeah, let's just do that. So we need to be a little bit careful about it. Well, it's it's still it's still pretty decent. On it. Okay, that looked like it hit a lot, but maybe not. Orders. So what if you move back more? Well, the chan hit chance doesn't really get better. Unfortunate. Unfortunate. Um, 
I guess. Right, torso destroyed. Well, that's not the center torso which we aimed for, unfortunately. Okay, he ejected. it. Well, that's, that works too. That works too for me. Now, what about you? What about you? We have 31% chance. Let's do this. And see, hopefully we can see the other reinforcements. No, we can't. So we we have to do some scouting afterwards because there should be more enemies incoming, but we'll worry about that next round. So, next turn. What are you doing? Oh, we can act first. Well, the problem is he will act next and he will very likely build more evasion, so I think we should hold on f up, with you. Boss? Just reserve. Okay, you attack this guy, that's fine. Did you keep the evasion? Yes, you did. Okay, that's good to know. Okay. Okay, we have enemies from that side incoming. So, how about you punching him from the front, I would say. So, maybe we can hit the, the leg. So, just do that. And then we'll move. Oh, Jesus. No! Well, that was bad. So, uh, we will need to move some guys over here. I mean, we can still maybe hit him. Just a little bit. And hopefully the buildings can take another hit. Uh, I'm not sure. Do I want to do a precision strike? It's not really much better. It's not really much better. Just fire away. Okay, right leg destroyed. That's much better than I anticipated. You surpassed my expectation. So you need to sink some heat at some point. So I would say... What if we... Do something like this? We should be able to at least fire the large laser. Uh, how is the heat? Well, the heat is not increasing too much. So if we just don't fire one of the mediums and maybe hit the second leg, it may work. We'll see. Got it. Well, the lasers missed. Well, everything missed as far as I can tell. That's a shame. Okay, now you. Well, we need to start moving towards the other direction, so just go over here and maybe shoot some lasers. And hopefully that finishes him off. Watch. No luck. No luck. Failed to connect. Yeah, fail connect. New round. All right, so uh, could be a vehicle, could be a mech. We don't know yet. So I think what you should do is maybe get some. Eh. Where can can we still? Let's put you to reserve. So he will stand up. No, he doesn't. Okay, so, how about you punching him again? How does the sound? Pretty good, so he's, he's out. Out of the equation. Perfect. Now, okay, we have another guy incoming from over there. Now you. Move here. 
and get some actual information. He only has one. What do we have here? A was oh, we have three more. Should we do a precision strike? I don't think we should. I think we should just do a normal attack. Well? Well, well, well. You did good, my friend. You did very well. So, next one. I don't think those guys will come in range this uh, uh, round, so... That should be fine. We can get rid of some heat. Pretty good. Uh, now, you can maybe move... Uh, do I want to move? Let's just move you over here. Affirmative. You get evasion and you are hidden in the trees. You're braced. Sounds good to me. And the good thing is we will be quite long ranged here. So we should be in an advantage. Oh, we, could, we have some vehicles here. A galleon. Okay, so what about Where you? you what about you? You could move over here and actually have a direct shot. Let's you do that. Us. Let's see whether you can actually take it out. 68 with the AC5 isn't too bad. What what does this thing have? Medium laser and, a, and some small lasers, so he won't be in range for any time soon, so just not a threat at the moment. Just hit it. And you killed it anyway. Perfect. You like that? Well, it is a half skull mission, but for a half skull mission there are quite a lot of enemies. I mean, we have three mechs there, we had one mech here and a couple of vehicles, or at least this is, this is a vehicle, this could be a mech as well. We don't really know. So, uh, just go into reserve. Reserving action. Until they may come in range. Which they yep. don't. We could go into... Oh. Co could go into the tree here and get a side shot on this guy. It's a Hetzer. Oh, this guy has an AC-20. We need to get rid of the, rid of him ASAP. Like... Jesus. We need to kill this thing before he comes too close. This is a very dangerous. So... Yeah. We really need to get rid of him. I may actually want to do a precision strike here, depending on... Well, we can just fire the large laser anyway, so just fire away. 40. Good. This thing is dangerous if it comes too close. An AC-20 is very dangerous. Uh, and we have the spider. Not really sure about you. Just reserve. Done. Okay, they don't do anything either. So, it comes closer. Next. Just, I would say, um, we will save you for the moment and we'll shoot especially the PPC. Which misses again. <sighs> it doesn't get any better, doesn't it? Forty? Is that no? It doesn't. It's not enough. You fork. What about you? You can fire the LRMs. Okay, just fire the LRMs. That's fine. If you hit, that is. Which you don't. So you wait. Now it moves. Just a little bit. Just a tiny bit. Uh, we would have a shot on him, but I don't think I want to do that. Hunkering down. Uh, reserve. See whether they come forward. 
we do have a scorpion SRM with two SRM sixes. He won't be in range of the buildings anyway. Uh, but so I think we still want to take him out first if we can. Should be enough? Not? Holy shit. How much HP does he have? Well, we, we hit... He has nothing anymore. 1 HP, 2 HP, 3 HP. He has absolutely nothing anymore. So, um... Come forward. And I think you will shoot the other guy. I think that should be more productive. Maybe we can actually do precision strike on the front. Uh -huh. That should be the yeah, vehicle destroyed. Perfect. I like I that. About the guys. Yeah. Yes, Commander. Just shoot the little guys. It's fine. I promise. Uh, no, we don't need the precision strike. Just take him 73. With vehicle destroyed. Awesome. Is that all? Reporting. Is that everything? Yes, it is. Mission Very well done. then. Well, yeah, it was a half skull mission, so as expected, not too difficult. Interestingly enough, it gave us quite a lot of money and salvage, so that is nice. Yeah, you... I'm still not sure about your Ching Street trade. <clears throat> I'm really not sure. Why do we get so little experience? That's strange. Okay, we can take one sol salvage. Um, we could take the AC-20. Probably wouldn't be the worst. It takes 14 tonnage. I mean, that's crap ton or some SRM 6s would be nice as well not sure let's get the AC20 because the chances that we get an SRM 6 is higher uh, randomly so eh not quite but we did get two machine guns I mean that's also something we could use so we can make a Mealy mech. I still want to refit the Shadowhawk. I think that's uh, something we should do uh, before we jump to the next to the next system. So yeah, that went that went pretty good. I'm happy how that turned out. Well, we do have to wait four days anyway. So, we want to do this contract as well. It's an escort, which is a little bit of a pain. What does the desert actually say? The desert biome is a rocky wind swept wasteland with little vegetation and little water. The extreme heat makes it more difficult for Max to sink heat. Fields of crystal are mineral deposits interfere with targeting systems. Okay, it seems to be pretty much the same as, as the last one. We didn't have too much trouble with heat, uh, surprisingly, actually. So, what about you? We could have used this, uh, the AC, the, the SRM6s at this point, so we could replace the LRM5, but what can you do? We didn't got it, so, well, we have the AC20 now, but I, I don't think we have any really use for it. We could refit you, but how? LRM 10s? It takes 14 tonnage. That's a little bit of a problem. We don't really have 14 tonnage, basically on any mech. So maybe maybe it was wrong to take this one. It was just. I know it's it's a it's a powerful gun. It does a lot of damage when it hits. But yeah, when it hits. So, hmm, not sure. 
I think the spider is fine. We could technically replace one of the lasers with some machine guns. But we don't have machine gun ammo, so that's out of the question as well. Okay, so how about we just let a day pass and see what the end of the month brings us. So we are down to 1 million again. Which is fine. I think we will stay at normal. Plus 5 morale, plus 1 tax. What is tax? I don't know what tax exactly means. But let's get financially stable first before we do anything stupid. Um, okay, so we need to wait three days. Come on, guys. So. We should have mech warriors up and running. Can we distribute some experience? You do have some... Uh, maybe we can do... This is the only thing that is productive, but you won't be piloting a good mech anyway. So, uh, it's not worth it. Let's just save it. Good to go. You're still out for another three days. Jesus. Waiting for orders. Good to go. Nobody else has anything... Any significant experience. It seems to be much harder to gain experience in this mod pack, so, um, yeah. We, uh, we need to be a little bit... Um, uh, yeah, I don't know, I don't know yet what, what we can do about this. We've had reports of, uh, America... Oh, you know what? Let's... Let's do, uh, before we go into the next mission, uh, let's do, let's wrap the, the, the episode up here and uh, we will do the, this mission in the next episode. Hope I see you there. Thanks for watching and bye bye.